Hello Horror Fanatics, this is JR369, welcome back for another brand new video review, and today is almost the last day of October, so today I'll be taking a look at the Pop Movies Beetlejuice number 640 in 41, Hot Topic exclusive, Lydia Deeds, and Beetlejuice by Funko. Finally we got a Lydia Deeds. Deeds pop of her, and also we got a a new version of Beetlejuice with a different head sculpt, not like the one from the other pop line. Now I'll take a look at the packaging here. The packaging is pretty much exactly the same as the um, tour guide Beetlejuice pop box here. You get the image, the characters here. You get the Hot Topic exclusive sticker here and everywhere. Yeah, it's just a normal pop box with Beetlejuice box in it. And on the back here, there's only two pops in this line. No other characters like Adam or uh, Daniel. I forgot Gina Davis's character's name. <sighs> I better look it up on Google. Man, it's been a while watching that movie. So that's about it for the box. Now let's release Beetlejuice and Lydia out of the box. Here we got Lydia and Beetlejuice out of the box. Let's start off with ladies first, because I want to be a gentleman. Let's start off with Lydia Deeds, played by Winona Ryder. I mean, by the look of this pop here, I think it looks really cool. The head scope on her looks really nice. It looks really, it looks really exactly like the one she does in the film. You know, the hairstyle, the dress, everything. You get the, like one of those... Um, I have no idea what these call because I don't, because you know I'm not a wedding, wedding expert. I just don't know what those are. And also, you can see she is holding flowers for the, you know, you know how you see in wedding people holding flowers are. Uh, nothing much to it here on the uh, dress here. You get like one of those um puffers whatever they're called you see sh see her high heels there and not much and also there's no peckles in the bottom of the feet i mean i mean she does stand really good with this thing on here i mean sometimes you want to have articulation in on, on it doesn't hinders the um anything it just it's just that i mean overall i say this pop looks really cool so there you got Lydia Deeds. Now let's start off with Beetlejuice. Now the head scope on him looks very, very much better. I think it looks really good. It's really much better than the um than the the, the uh, old Beetlejuice pop that we got back in I gotta say 2013 maybe. I don't know. I better look up on Pop Price Guide the year. I mean, take a look. At the pop here, you can see some of the ugly molds or, or I have no idea, molds. You have definitely molds. You can see some of the speckles here. You get the, uh, the suit there. And also you can see the little finger he's holding with the wedding finger on it. Man, where does he get that? God, man, that is so disturbing. And also you can see his little, he has the... His wrist watch here. You can see the uh, the little ring here. You can see like the buttons there. You get the mold on his wedding suit here. And also you can see like a it's an underneath sleeve shirt here. You get the um shirt right there. And also you can see another shirt here. And also some buttons on the um, the vest here. Nothing much on the sh on the pants here. Just the crease wrinkles here. Nice, nice shoes, by the way. The white shoes looks really good. And also, there's pegos on the bottom. Of the, I mean, no pegos. I mean, there's nothing much on the bottom. Just legal crap. So, 
overall, I gotta say these these pops look really cool. I absolutely love this pop. I think it looks really cool. I personally love these. They look really cool, and they also fit perfectly at your um as your uh, I gotta say um cake tops for your wedding cakes. I mean that would be awesome and. If you use these as cake tops on top of your cakes on wedding days, that would be even cool. There's like another version of Lydia that is exclusively to box lunch, which is the um, the one in her goth outfit here. I'm very excited. I already ordered it and I cannot wait to get it. And also there's the rock candy one, which is I'm pretty sure I'm going to get her probably in the next year at the 31 Horror Toys in 31 Days. For the new Beetlejuice figure, the head sculpt, it looks perfect. I mean, it looks accurate to the character itself. I mean, I really wish Funko could update a Beetlejuice pop. You know, like the... You know, like the, um... Like the body. Or maybe a movie moment with the same head. You know, that says it's showtime. Yeah, that would be cool. But overall, these pops are fantastic. They look really cool. So that's about it. Make sure to tune in for new videos daily. Don't forget to turn on the bell icon to be notified new videos after you subscribe. And follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Both of the links will be in the description down below. So that's about it. This is JR369. And goodbye.